Hello everybody, Drifty here from Driftwood Gaming, and today we are going to be doing a special request video. Uh, Arcana asks me in the comments, he wanted to replicate a, a red mage skill from uh, Final Fantasy XI, and the skill he wants to replicate is called Convert. And in Final Fantasy XI, it basically takes um, all of your HP and converts it into MP, except for one, so you, it doesn't kill you. Um, but how you would do it in RPG Maker MV, um, you would need a couple plugins. So you're going to go to uh, your plugin manager and add those plugins if you don't already have them. And I have uh, several videos that show you how to add plugins, even a video specifically for that. So you could reference those videos if you don't know how to do that to save time here. Add the Yanfly Engine Core Engine and the Yanfly Engine Skill Core. And then go to your skills in the database, create a new skill. Uh, give it a name, give it an icon uh, in the description, Give it, uh, let the player know what it's going to be doing. In this case, <clears throat> as specified at, uh, by Arcana, uh, he wants it to take 80% of your current HP and restore your MP at a ratio of 3 to 1. So 3 HP for 1 MP. Um, for the skill types, up to you. Don't give it any cost here because we're using the lunatic mode right here for the skill cost. Uh, here's the code you're going to be putting in the note tags. Custom HP cost, um, cost plus equals user dot HP times point eight semicolon. Don't forget that. And then the bracket slash custom HP cost to let the game know that we're done making our own equations. And that's going to basically say it's going to cost 80% of the user's HP. And then for message, whatever you want, I just went with uses and I didn't give it any required type. Uh, the scope, I went with the user and the Cajun, maybe you want to do battle screen unless you want them to be able to use it out of battle. It's up to you. <clears throat> you want to go with certain hit though because you don't want to end up wasting 80% of your your HP for nothing. Uh, I gave it a, cu a custom animation but you can give it whatever you like. Uh, the damage type, you're going to go MP recover and no element. The reason why you want none is if you have a piece of armor that's like say fire, fire breastplate and it gives you 50% uh, you take 50% less fire damage. And if your element for this is uh, fire damage, then you're also going to restore 50% less uh, MP because it's fire. So just go with none unless you uh, like make a specific one for it. Variance, you want zero unless you want to change that. Critical, I don't think you'd want to do that because then it would kind of destroy the equation. But it's up to you. It's your game. You could really make it uh, however you like. This is just my template that you can use to modify. Um, after you do that, um, copy the, everything to your liking, but towards this, uh, let's go ahead and test it out and I'll show it to you guys. We're going to fight this uh, slime that's got almost a million HP real quick. Got to go here though. Uh, one more thing, don't forget to go to your actors and then uh, I'll show you that real quick. Don't forget to go to your actors and uh, or classes rather and assign it. Uh, otherwise you won't be able to use it because you don't know it. So you just select it there and give it whatever level requirement you want. Okay, now we'll try it. All right, so it's going to cost 932 HP with our current 1165. That seems about 80 percent, and it restored 400. Nice. So 233 HP remaining. It's going to take 186. And it restored 80. 186. Hmm. So that seems to be a little bit more than a 1 to 3 ratio. So how you would change that, I'll show you. Let's see, 37 and then 17. So 17 divided by 37 divided by 3. Yeah, so it's restoring a little bit more than 1. Uh, it, uh, uh, another thing about this skill is it won't, uh, it's not slip damage, so it won't kill you. It'll take you down to 1 HP, and then you can just use it over and over, and it'll keep restoring. You can see there. But um, in order to modify that, all you would have to do is change this number. So let's go from 1.7 to 1.6, since it's giving us a little bit more than a third of the, the HP we're using.
I did a rough play test, but I'm like, oh, it looks about right. <laughs> okay. 932, and it gave us 373. So we got 932 divided by 3, and what is that? 310. So that was pretty close. It gave us, what, 317? Let's try that again. 186 gives us 75. So let's go 186 divided by 3. 75. So it's still giving us a little bit more than uh, a third. It makes it a, a complicated equation because it's calculating, it's taking the 80% the away before it calculates. So let's go 1.5 and try it one more time. And you can manipulate this number to give it just the right amount for you. I'm just trying to, to gear it specifically to what, you're, what you asked for. 186 and it gave 70. 62. So it's pretty, pretty close. Um, I would actually leave it like right there. Uh, if you give it any variance, of course, that number is going to go up and down. But uh, that's basically it. Now I'm just playing with numbers. So I'll let you guys go. Thank you guys for watching. Give it a thumbs up if this video was helpful. Um, if it gave you an Id any ideas like that. Subscribe to the channel if you want more content like this. I'll be making more RPG Maker MV tutorials. Thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate you all. And uh, leave your comments below if you have a, a, a skill you want to replicate from another game or you have an, a, something you get stuck on in V. I really like your comments because you guys uh, teach me things. You guys, uh, give, you guys ask questions that I uh, have to answer and figure out these things. So I really appreciate it. You guys are awesome. Thank you for watching again, and we'll see you in the next tutorial.